Hello everybody, and welcome back to Let's Play Spelunky. Last time we had quite an abysmal failure. It was a sad episode, to be sure. Um, I'm not even sure if we got to the jungle? I don't remember clearly. We played as Van Helsing, who we unlocked in the episode prior to last one. He ended up failing us completely. He was not the man for the job. And who's the man for the job? Why not anyone else than this boy here? Boy. Because everyone knows that the real man, the real men, are only the boys among us. So we're going with Meat Boy! And we're gonna start off in the beginning, and we're gonna work our way down to that temple. And we are going to defeat Olmec. Because... That is our main goal, I guess. <clears throat> main goal for our series so far. So... Beat up the snake. Ah, oh, yes! Beat that dumbass skeleton. But yeah, so let's see. Uh, oh man, Monty's up. The dog is up there. Poop. Let's see. Okay, we're gonna hop on up here. Those gems might not have been worthwhile, but it definitely is for us to get to the dog, which doesn't quite look like it'll be a possibility. You know what, guys? We're gonna try something stupid. Holy shit, it worked. Okay, that is a good sign. That is a good sign for this video. We're down two ropes, down one bomb, but we're gaining a lot of gold early on, and that allowed us to get the dog. So, I'm, I'm happy with where we are now. That, oh, oh god. Stay away from me, skeleton. All my life, I've always been hated by skeletons. If anyone knows what that's from, you get super cool points. It's the best movie ever made. Get out of here, skeleton. For anyone who doesn't know, it was Lost Skeleton of Kadavra. The Lost Skeleton of Kadavra. Very good movie. If you're, if you're a fan of uh, cheesily horrible movies, which I am a huge fan of, that is the movie for you. I love that movie so much. Okay! So let's see, we didn't make it, uh, our gold count didn't get quite as high as I had hoped in this video, but... <laughs> the dog lip licking him a fresh slap of meat there. Um... Didn't get as, quite as much gold as I had hoped we would, and now we're stuck with this dark floor. Which I hate with all my being. Hopefully if we got a bad thing there... I don't know what I'm saying, I don't know what I'm thinking. Crap! I wanted to buy the paste. Um, it went, it went too fast, went on too much of a spending spree. Come on, you could get up here. Drop down the torch so we can grab this gem. I would like to drop... Oh man, this is scary. Okay, we're fine. I would like to pop a rope here. So I think I will, actually. Yes, that will allow us to get back at our stuff. <clears throat> our main issue right now is definitely money. Oh god, no! Fucking spiders! That was a good run. God. Oh! The, skeletor the skeletons are everywhere in this video. I don't like them one bit. Whatever. That's, um, an unfortunate poor start, but, um, we could definitely come back from this. That you. I'm just disappointed because that was shaping up to be a cool run with, like, that bomb throw. The darkness uh, floor on the second stage kind of sucked, but... Oh, well, we, we have things shaping up right here. We got some free bombs initially, which is super nice. Get back here. Oh, the pretty lady! The pretty lady! Is that... The Simpsons? I am amazed that that didn't blow up there. <laughs> I thought... I thought we could have gotten ourselves a free 500 gold, but I guess the game wasn't working with us with that there. Like, a tiny rock hits it, and it... 
uh, starts off this huge explosion, but if a huge boulder crashes down, nothing, apparently. It's kind of weird. Alright, we'll drop a bomb right there. We spotted our shop. I'm not sure what he has yet, but... No! Oh, no! Wow, what a disaster. We killed what was ever in what it, what was in that pot without suffering any damage. You know what? We're gonna make this this one fun. Yeah, eat that shopkeeper. What you got in that box? A web gun. That sucks. We really should go back up there, especially since there's probably a damsel up here. But I'm a little broken-hearted after all that. I've become simply crestfallen, like a crestfallen warrior in Dark Souls. Oh well. We'll, we'll... There's ne- <laughs> Stupid dog. Okay, let's see. <laughs> stupid, stupid dog. So, there really hasn't been... We, we, we ha haven't had any reason to be, like, feeling down in the dumps right here. We, nothing has doomed us entirely. I mean, we, we, all we have is our shotgun. We're not in, like, the best place. And the compass is nice, but that machete there. Have we picked up the machete? We have not. Machete just works as a, a stronger version of the whip. But I don't like it because it, uh, you have to carry it like you do the shotgun. The, the, the tooth that we saw in an earlier episode, that one replaces the whip, so it's without a doubt a straight-up upgrade to the machete and the whip, of course. Now let's see, um... Let's see if we can crush this guy. Oh, he's a bit too fast for us, but... We can get him, uh, as he comes back. BAM! The poor, poor snake. At least we gave him a quick death. Like, imagine... I wonder how many people die a year from being crushed by things, though. It's an interesting statistic to find out. Also, probably pretty scary. I don't know if I'd want to know that, but... It would certainly be interesting. The ghost is here, so we've got to skedaddle. We can actually forget about collecting all this gold. That's... That's one thing I... <clears throat> Probably shouldn't have done on that floor. Absolutely wonderful, just what we needed. <laughs> this is a oh, that's nice though. Be glad to get some pace. But yeah, this has been an unfortunate run so far. There's there's not a spider up there. I thought I spotted one. Okay, what we just got was a scarab or like a, a glow bug. They're, they're scarabs, but I like to call them glow bugs. Ooh, hey, they're scorpion. Oh God. He's too good for us. Oh. Oh my god. Holy guacamole! Okay, we're fine. But yeah, basically the, those golden scarabs, you pick them up and they give you some gold, so that, that they're one of the positives about the darkness floors. It's definitely a lot easier to get a, a larger sum of gold on these floors. Oh man. We're gonna drop this down. Okay, wonderful. Nothing bad here. Get out of your rat, I don't want you. Shopkeeper's gonna be dangerous at the end of this floor, that's for damn sure. I really wish our crates would have been better for us on this floor. We've gotten a lot of crates, but none of them have really been all that worthwhile. Let's drop that down there. And hit him. Well, we picked him up! <laughs> Alright. We got beaten up. I, I should have just ran, should have just gone through the exit, but I wanted to pick up a shotgun for future use. Clearly that was a mistake. Alright, we are starting fresh on this run right here. We're not gonna anger any shopkeepers, hopefully they won't get mad at us. And we are just gonna make our way onwards to the temple. We've got two crates, which is really nice, I'm happy about that. Got some bombs. I would be fine finding some ropes in here. Or spring shoes! Booyah! I love the spring shoes. You would think they wouldn't be all that useful, but it is really nice to be able to jump uh, an extra space higher than you normally would. It makes me very happy. I just wish they had like a boing sound effect that could happen. 
whenever you jump, like you go like a boing, a boing. That'd be great. Like imagine how yes, more bombs. Imagine how cool it would be if actual like spring shoes existed in real life. Did they used to sell those? I feel like I saw them on an episode of like Malcolm in the Middle or something. Like some character got like shoes with springs on the bottom and it, they actually like made them bounce like super high. Uh, I can't complain about getting the spectacles at this point. We've already gotten a huge boon of items on this floor. Sure, we could go that way. I think I saw a crate over there. I might be... Uh, <laughs> we'll go for that one so we can get those rubies. Diamonds, rubies, bam bam. That guy. I don't know the lyrics of that song. But, uh, because I never watched that show. I believe that's an intro to a show, but whatever. What was I talking about? Like, real life spring shoes. I would buy those instantly if anyone sold them. Like, and they worked. They would be like. I'm sure the risk of death with them would be huge, like, astronomical, but. <laughs> Because they'd be pretty dangerous, but I would totally get those. I'd be the coolest kid on the block if I had them. Brag to everyone else, be like, hey, hey Charlie, you bullied me all my life, but now I've got these spring shoes, how do you feel about that? And then he'd run home and cry to his parents. Then I'd probably get in trouble for bragging, but, you know, it'd all be worth it. Let's buy these climbing gloves and these bombs. Those will definitely be cool together. Um, spring shoes and climbing gloves. Makes our spring shoes seem a little bit less worthwhile, but I think they're probably even more worthwhile now, because, like, let's see. What if we were here? Oh, well, that's a bad example. What if we were here? Probably could have gotten there anyways. But whatever. They're useful together. <laughs> Means that ropes... Would well, we could take the boom rank. Boom rank's always fun. This will mean that ropes will, um, pretty much be useless, frankly. Well, not useless, but we'll, we'll be able to stock up on ropes. We definitely will, I doubt we'll ever run low on ropes. That's 100% for sure. Grab this handsome man, look down. We can grab this gold. Gotta be careful with those spikes and that arrow trap. I don't think that arrow trap has been triggered. Might as well check for fun. Yeah, there must have been some monster that triggered it. Like, I saw that arrow, but I wasn't sure if that was, um... Triggered from that specific arrow trap or not. We jumped so goddamn high with these shoes. What am I mainly missing right now? I would say the paste. I would really like to get some paste. I think I'll save up money for these. That bomb box instead. We're not too far off from that. But yeah, like, um, I haven't seen any... I'm a little bit scared of getting back up. Actually, why, why would I be? We can make that. Okay, what am I saying? Come back here, Boomerang. I love you. We definitely... Get out, get out of here, spider. I would really... That's what I think we're missing out on the most. Pace, 100%. Because I really love my paste, my sticky white substance of extreme importance, but, but yeah, like, I mean, we don't need it, but it, it basically it would be really helpful. I love the, the paste is always a good item to have, stick bombs to areas and all that jazz, yeah. So hopefully we'll come up on a grandfather spiders soon. I believe that's what they're called, I'm not sure. The, the big spiders, the big... If we don't, uh, maybe we could pick some up by sacrificing a damsel to that altar to Kali down there. There we go, okay. And here's our studly man with his wonderful double chin. All the characters kind of have a double chin in this game, but I think it, like, it's definitely a lot more visible on this young man here. Drop a bomb, go on down. Too bad I didn't get any of those gems right there. Those were Snake. Snake! Snake! Pick 
pictures of it. That is interesting. How many floors? We still have one more floor to get a grandfather spider, so not all is lost for game of pace. Pitcher's Mid is really cool for throwing items, but quite frankly, I think the Pitcher's Mid really goes down in value if you don't have the pace, but let's take this arrow, actually. Well, now it's going to be used up, so... I was gonna say we could take the arrow because we have. Oh, cool. Easy to Jedi. I was gonna take. We could take the arrow because the uh, pitcher's mitt would make its use. May I make it much more viable for use, but. Uh, but it only has one use, anyways, and we used it up, so. Entirely useless after, after the fact. Hey! No! Can't complain about bombs, though. Bombs are always good. Oh god. I really, um... I need to figure out... It, oh god. I need to figure out exactly how... No! Ah, oh, stupid... Whatever. I need to figure out... Yes! Our prayers have been, have been answered. We got our grandfather's uh, spider or whatever. Let's figure out what he's called exactly. Giant spider, not a grandfather spider. Don't blow me up. Let's drop this right here. We could blow those up. I'll stay away from that TNT. Only ropes. Oh, but we also got this one down here. Always a good example of why exploring is best. These spring shoes. I thought the spring shoes would be more useful than they have been. <laughs> I gave an incredible boom to the spring shoes, but... Uh, who knows, maybe I haven't noticed when they've been really useful to us. Whoa, watch out, spider. Gotta end your life, like I did. But yeah, like... Drop this beautiful woman off. Let's just go off to the next floor. We made it to the jungle! Made it to the jungle, we have a great supply of items. Especially... Ooh! And we've already found our black market. Somewhere around here. I saw that blink really quick. Do I spot it anywhere? Yes, indeed. I believe I spot it. I believe it's, like, directly below us. Right under where that big gold stash is. Maybe wrong, but I, I think it's there. So we definitely don't want to die before going there. We don't have enough to buy the Ankh. Honestly... Even if they have a- well, if they had a jetpack, I'd rather get the jetpack than the Ankh, but... If I had enough for the Ankh, I would be pretty tempted to get the Ankh right now. Just to give us a... a second life if we needed it. Okay, oh! Okay, I was a little bit worried there. Let's see, with our... Wonderful uh, pitcher's mid and paste. We might be able to make it to there. But yeah, only one bomb usage. That's awesome. And we killed that sucker for on it. Yeah, we can pick up this. Oh! Oh my god. Well, that sucked. <laughs> now we have to sacrifice something to Kali. Oh, shoot. I didn't even notice it's a water level. Can we kill the big fish? I've never killed the big piranha before. There are so many goddamn piranhas down there. Okay, let's see. Where is the damsel? Let's just get rid of that. I don't even want to mess with that thing. We can sacrifice this to... Come on. Damsel might not even... Oh, uh, yep, there she is. She's like always underwater on these floors. We're wasting a bunch of bombs, but I think it'll be worth it to get her. We could toss one right there and that'll get us to her without killing her. Be quick, though. Leave me alone. Oh my god. Okay, sweet. Now we could just uh, drop her off at the... Uh, this thingamajig, Kali. <laughs> Don't kill her. And we have our Kapala as well. Wonderful. Okay. We lost two hearts going through all that, but I think it was definitely worth it, as long as these shopkeepers don't get pissed off at us. I always have to be scared of 
the black market because these guys get angry so quickly so easily too maybe should have saved money shouldn't have bought that so fast yeah because there's a jetpack down here little disappointed in myself but uh hopefully we won't need it you know what the jetpack let's just pretend that the jetpack is more of a risk to us <laughs> if we if we took the jetpack our play might go down like you know like our our skills we ooh, we could we could also gamble a little try, to try to get the jetpack here too we'll, we'll do that oh good sign so far yes okay but yeah like i was saying if we took the jetpack we might, like, become too confident, and our confidence could be our ultimate downfall. Oh my god. I would really like to get the jetpack, though, so I hope this keeps working out. We definitely... Oh, poop. I know we could keep gambling, but I don't want the ghost to come and beat us, so we're gonna move on. Oh, no. Okay, good. Okay, good. I'm gonna toss bombs down here. I don't want to deal with this at all. Like, I knew that was gonna happen. I mean, we have enough ropes. Maybe could have made that with... Just in case. Yeah, eat that, monkey. You're a jerk. There are so many spikes here! This is the worst area I've ever seen. We'll just keep blowing it up. We've got 53 bombs. Could be a huge waste, but I don't want to die here. Like, this would be the worst thing ever. Okay, just... Oh, God. Give me your blood, monkeys. Sweet. Okay, we're at six hearts. That makes me a lot happier. Got out before the ghost got us. See, if we kept gambling and we didn't get enough money for the jetpack, we almost certainly would have died down there. So I'm actually happy that we left. Yeah, ropes. That's worth it. Um, I'm really scared, guys. <laughs> I don't know. God, damn it! I've gotten really nervous right now because I don't want us to die. Like more nervous than usual. Like we haven't made it very far in the last few uh, in our last few play st play sessions. So I guess it's like destroyed my confidence. I'm really nervous right now. Even with six hearts and the Kapala and all that, I really don't want us to die. But that's probably good. Like, confidence might have been our downfall the last few uh, sessions, so. Sorry. Sorry, my wonderful, handsome dog, but we gotta beat him up a bit. We want this blood, this fresh blood for us. Come on in here, Mr. Bat. Jump on your head. Whoop. Oh my. Okay. Cool. Alright, um... I think we have one more floor of the jungle. Yeah, we've got one more floor, but we're about to make it down to the ice caves. So, ooh, and we could get a shotgun on this level. Oh, there's our dance hall right, too. And a cape! Fantastic! I'm actually really happy about this. The cape will be very good for us. With the cape, we act a little bit less... Oh, wait. Sorry, lady. We're gonna... We're gonna make you bleed. I wanna watch you bleed! We are in the jungle, so... That reference, um... Okay, actually, that's really good. I was gonna complain about the cape being there, but that's actually perfectly fine for us. I'm not messing with any of this junk. I still got 45 bombs. We're gonna be perfectly fine. We, uh, uh, not if we'd be a little bit reckless with them, but if we're... Oh my god! Okay! That was terrifying. <laughs> he was almost a kamikaze guy there. Whoa! I don't know if I've ever seen this combination before. A dead or restless floor mixed with the, uh, the water floor. 
We are not going to get our shotgun, unfortunately, because we could, but I don't want to deal with all that crap. <laughs> not just to grab the shotgun, it is not worth it. Like, if we blew up the rock that the shotgun was in, it would just fall to the floor and we'd lose it there. Hello, Mr. Tunnelman! Hello there! I'm the Tunnelman! I was taking a shortcut, but there was a lot of monsters down there. Ooh! Sorry, buddy. Next time you see me, can you bring me a shotgun? I'll try. Could have gotten you one there, but like I said, that would not have been worth it. Let's drop one down here. We could spend some... We probably should spend some time looking for the damsels, actually. I'm just worried that we might get ourselves frozen again like that one time. <laughs> that one time was pretty bad, though. Like, very... That was a huge amateur mistake. We could drop on down here. Ah, there's the... You have the... Oh. I hate you, Mr. Mr. Alien Man. He's a real alien man. Okay, let's see. Wonderful! Sorry, dog. Okay, and here's our exit. We could sacrifice a bunch of these... You know what? We're gonna sacrifice as many of these dudes as we can. Oh god. Oh. Oh god. Get out of here, alien. I don't like you. Your parents don't like you. Nobody likes you. That's... That was mean of me. I'm sorry, Mr. Alien. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry guys, like I said, I'm pretty nervous. Don't want to go anywhere near the situation with that thing. Okay, let's see. Well, I don't know if we could get that guy anymore, but we could take his friend. We already bumped him over the head. Don't want to anger Kali. Oh my god. Get out of here! Eat that. Yeah. Okay. All for like two sacrificing points or whatever, but on the ice cave, so it probably won't end up having been worthwhile, but we probably picked up some extra blood doing all that, and oh my god, this is awesome! Okay. Oh shoot, we almost angered Kali there. We gotta drop right here. Drop that down. Grab ourselves some blood. No! He almost walked off. Okay, let's see. And there we go! We got some extra hearts. Is he in with the shopkeeper? He is not. That shopkeeper is selling a jetpack! Boo! Yeah, we're definitely grabbing that. And we can sacrifice these dudes on the side as well. Thank you, Kali. She is ecstatic with me. That's cool. I don't know what that happened already, but... Let's gotta be quick about that. Sweet, we picked him up. Not any of the shopkeeper's items. And... There's another one over here. We'll buy the jetpack before going for him, though. Just to be... Are you serious? It is amazing how quickly prices ramp up in this game. It makes sense, because you get gold a lot faster as you move on, but that's pretty disappointing. We might not be able to make it to the- OH FUCK! <laughs> I want to throw a bomb on there! But I landed on the frickin' bouncy thing, and so I angered Kali accidentally. Okay. Lesson learned, take things slow. Let's just get out of here. I don't want to deal with any of this anymore. Let's just get to the goddamn temple. Probably could have gone enough in all to get the jetpack, but... I am... The... Get out of here, spider. I wish there was a counter somewhere, like in here, if there was a counter for like how many points you have with Kali, that'd be really cool, I'd like that a lot. Let's grab this idol, maybe we could use it as a shopkeeper later. So sorry Kali, I didn't mean to piss you off. We were so
so close, but then I accidentally blew up her altar. Get out of here, mister. Okay. Damn. <laughs> I was about to say we made it to the temple, but we've got one more floor. Oh yeah, should have known that. The, there's always this thing here before we get to the final floor. The rope. Uh, we can make it to that rope. We can make it to that rope. There we go. We could go to the alien place, but we're definitely not going there until we see a mall neck. Okay, drop on down. Sweet, another shopkeeper. He's got some bombs. I'm actually really happy about this compass, too. We haven't picked up a compass still now, so that's uh, a good get for us. Wonderful! At long last, we have made it to the temple. Time to take on Olmec if we can. <laughs> Alright, so let's see. I hear prayers to Kali. I believe that's actually this thing? This pit here? This pit? It's one of the traps, of course, since there is the, um... The idol here. Man, we have 22 hearts. That is wonderful. Taking... There will always be the damsel there and the, uh... The idol, I believe. I believe they're always there. Those thwomps, they are our biggest threat here. I believe, at least. On the first floor, our biggest threat may be... There, oh my god, Anubis. Our biggest threat on this first floor is actually probably Anubis. I don't know, may maybe Anubis is tied with the... With the, the thwomps. Whatever they'd be called. We're actually gonna trigger this trap right here. Woo! Oh! Oh god! Wake up! Wake up! No! 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 Oh my god! I can't believe it. Oh my god, what a stupid mistake. Okay, guys, uh, that's going to do it for this episode. If you enjoyed, please like, comment, and or subscribe. Um, any of them really help the channel, so they're, they're much love uh, to you guys. E even just watching, you guys are all great. I love you guys. But, um, but yeah, uh, I hope you guys enjoyed. I am the Egg Scrambled Gamer, and I will see you all next time.